The South African Open, presented by the city of Joburg, has come to Rand Park, where the championship will be decided over two excellent courses. A top for a par for Ben and Grace is for a round of 66. And a sound start to his South African title chase. Back over to the Bushwillow and the par 5 17th and Matt Wallace. Also, grand shot. Let's go to Kitayama at the par 3, 191. Yeah, oh, beautiful. Well done. He's really putting together something very special there. And talking about men with a good sense of humour, Louis is just that. He, you wouldn't know it, would you, watching him out there on the golf course? I don't know whether you remember that uh, that tweet of his when he finished runner-up at the PGA Championship in 2017 last year. Is he going to make it? Is he going to make it? Yes, He's got another one. When he mimicked that song. That was brilliant, wasn't it? Yeah. This is Lombard looking for an eagle three. We know it's going to come a little from his left. And what a fight back in. He started birdie, drop shot, triple drop. This for a sixth birdie on the day, but it's an eagle. And well done to Xander Lombard. He's already had a tough couple of years. But look at that. How about that for a wonderful fight? Back to Manalitzo for a third birdie in a row. Hold your line, hold your line, hold your line, and go. Well done. What a fantastic three in a row. Double bogey 13. Bird 14, 15, 16 to take the lead by one shot. Back to the 14th hole. Bushwiller, Charles Schwarzel. Let's see if he can control the spin a bit better. Might be easier at that semi-rough. Settle. Oh, quality. Oh, no, marvellous shot. So he hasn't got, he's got a very precise little shot coming up. No more than I would think about 50, top 60 yards. Yeah, I would have thought he would have laid back a little bit further, but he got a lot more run than he expected. He can nip that very nicely. And oh oh, settle down, don't go too fast. Find it. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, your beauty. <laughs> it's an eagle three for Charles Schwartzel. Well, well, well. Birdie eagle to get to 12 under and lead the SA Open. He's had some near misses in the SA Open. Will this be the year when Schwartzel collects the title? But he has been good so far today, and this has got a chance. Ah. Oh! He's found another one. <laughs> Four in a row for Ernie Els. Ten under par, two off the lead. Would you believe it? Matt Wallace for his birdie three. At number nine, he drove the green. Eagle putty here. Three birdies. So he goes to the turn in 32, no drop shots. Into the wind, I mean, that's a big, big tonk. What do you call it, a tonk? Stonker. A stonker. I must remember to put an S in front of tonk. Stonker. There's a stonker too. A tear. Bouncing back with the birdie. It's been a tough stretch for the Zambian. Double bogeys at five, at ten. Here's Louis. Third shot. Down into the par five, not what he'd want. Looks to have started right at the flag. There's not much room up there where the hole is cut. A fantastic shot. Well done. The check they get in the ball, Grant, the strikey is absolutely superb. As we've seen a couple of touch hold from here. It comes a little from his left. Maybe slightly uphill this one as well, just to help. There you go. Found another one. Three in four holes. As Wistason puts his foot on the accelerator, 
and moves four clear at the top. And Louis with the joint lowest round of the day, a 67 in these tough conditions at 14 under, three ahead of Matt Wallace of Schwarzel and Zambia's Madalitso Matia. Definite opportunity to pick up shots here. And he starts it right, I think it's staying right as well. Oh, oh, how about that for a bounce? That's the best bounce I've seen all week. <laughs> <laughs> no doubt about it. This is what uh, Scholl is left with. His third shot at 12 after blasting it right. Dry, tightish lie. Sounds like he's nipped it. Oh, that is an unbelievable shot from Scholl. Eagle putt of Langask. Yeah, good speed. Here's Romain Longas, the uh, Frenchman. Bird is at 12, at 13, and an eagle putt for him at 14. My word! Four under through three holes, Longas to 13 under, and he closes the gap to three shots. For par. Coming up short. Yeah, it's tricky coming uphill, downwind. Don't look for too much on the right here. Inside right, maybe tops or even straight in will do it. And that's what he's done. Yeah. What a wonderful up and down. And Roman Logask has booked himself a place at the Open Championship at Royal Port Rush in July next year after that closing 66. It's also going to be his best ever finish on the European Tour. Well done, him. He's not in the hazard, but I'll just try and get it back in play. Well, again, he's played an unbelievable shot because I think most mortals would have tried to play out sideways, but trying to play it along the water line from that line. Again, brave, but left it in a bad spot. Louis for his bogey, number two. Well held. So the lead is cut to two. Her stays and drops to 13 under. Louis coming up the tier. Certainly turn left or right. And again, I think this is double breaker at the end. Come on. Come on. Her stays and pounces. Yeah, well, I keep it nice and smooth here, Louis. Don't jump all over it. Just nice and smooth. Good release. And we'll get close. Well, he did tug one badly left at one time. But he likes it, and that is why. Up you come. Come on. Up you come, you little beauty. Only 381 yards from the team. We are at altitude, of course, 5,500 feet. Come on. Come on. Oh! You, how did that stop her? Well, the fifth straight three, as Warren has said, and a great recovery. Two over par after three. Four birdies since out of the couple under, and now at 16 under with a very convincing lead with nine holes to play. It's a lovely swing, this nice and calm, looks like the eight. And that be like it. What a wonderful shot from Ernst Hazen. And it's not over yet, but that could well take him to his first South African Open Championship. He'll be going there as champion. It's just a question of by how many, because this one is almost straight. He might want to go just a fraction right of centre. Yeah. Yep, walked it in. He knew where it was heading. Yep. I hope the start of great things to come over the next few years. Opened up this week with a round of 62. Surrendered the lead to Charles Schwartzel after 36 holes. But Louis Eustazen has won for the first time in three years. It's his first South African Open Championship. Lovely scenes around this 18th green, and he's won it by a handsome six shots. Here comes, here comes the bug. 
Certainly. So the title goes to Ustazen and the Open Championship spots go to Romain Longasque, to Charles Schwartzel and to Oliver Wilson as well. Congratulations to them. They book their passage to Royal Port Rush next July. But great family and friends are always um, with me and great is awesome. And of course you, you can't not thank your caddy. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Um, he was walking up here and Glenn was saying he wonders if, if this counts as two now. Joburg open and it's open. So. But yeah, he's been, he's been great. He's been phenomenal. And, um, you know, we had a tough start today and, and um, we just bite the bullet and, and told me that you swing it well, just go for it. To watch another European Tour video, click here. Or to subscribe, click here.